Hello everyone, I'm back again. So um, this haul that I have for you today, or right now, whatever you wanna call it, um, <laughs> this was the um, <sighs> the fine fragrance mist they had for, I think it was 59B5, I can't remember now. Things have been so hectic and I'm so sorry that I am so all over the place. Um, so, I bought um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I bought ten fine fragrance mists, um, and I believe I used a coupon because um, that would have equaled fifty dollars, and I didn't have enough to get the free shipping. So yeah, I believe I used a coupon on this maybe a 20% off or something. I'm not sure. But I also bought a candle that was, I think, $13.95 at the time. Um, we've had a lot of candle sales lately. We've had a lot of sales, period, lately. So um, the candle that I got, I'm going to show you first, um, is Salted Grapefruit Shore, which this, look at that jar. Isn't that cute? It is so cute. I love that packaging. It's beautiful. And then the lid is that, what is on there? I don't know, there's something on it. Um, that, uh, I don't know what you call that. It's like um, textured, it's like lumpy. <laughs> you can see the lines in it and you can feel them, you know? Okay, so anyway, when you open it up, oh, do you smell grapefruit? But it smells like a, a sweet grapefruit, not a real strong, if you don't like citrusy smells, you won't like this. But I do enjoy this. I, I mean, I wouldn't want to smell this all the time, but I think the candle smells really nice for a, um, you know, here and there kind of thing. I would definitely like, like burning this. And it smells like it's going to be a pretty strong one. So another candle. You know, I am... One of these days, well, probably when I get back from the campground, so this fall, I am going to get out all my candles, and we're going to go through them all, and you guys are going to be like, oh my God, she's absolutely crazy. <laughs> oh, you already know that, right? Okay, so the fine fragrance mist, I have 10 of them. Can y'all guess what I bought? <laughs> Some more tropical. Coconut pineapple. This is one of my favorites. Why? I don't know. I bought the coconut pineapple um, body wash, I think, a year or so ago. Never used it. Then when I, it all came back out this year and I started using this stuff, I absolutely love it. I love this stuff. So this one has shaved coconut, fresh pineapple, and sugar cane. And it just smells so good. So good. I mean, y'all know what it smells like, right? Purely. Pineapple and coconut, coconut, pineapple, and sugar, because it's sweet. Or just really ripe, because they have sugars of their own. I don't know, but that's what it smells like. Very good. So, I got another Among the Clouds, because I really like Among the Clouds. It's very nice. Um, we're going to spray it here. Smell like alcohol. There we go. There, I got the wild berry skies and the whipped vanilla clouds. <laughs> That's what I smelled. It was vanilla clouds. And wild berry skies. <laughs> My husband and I joke all the time when they put something in there that's like, you know, wild berry skies. I mean, what, it, what does that mean? You know, like that's what it smells like. So yeah, among the clouds. So I also got Bahamas passion fruit and banana flower. So this one is passion fruit, pineapple leaves, and banana flower. And we all know what all of these smell like, but I'm not smell them anyway because I like to. Mm, and yep, I love this. Mm. Now I didn't get the. Um, Pink Pineapple Sunrise because I already have like three backups of that. Um, and so I try not to get any more than that. Any more than that is just 
silly wasteful, I think. I think three backups is probably too many. <laughs> but if I can do it and nobody's, you know, who's going to stop me? <laughs> okay, for my next one, Waikiki Beach Coconut. And I did have all of these, every one of them that I bought. I already had. Oh, this one is delicious too. This one is a very sweet coconut smell. If anybody doesn't know, tropical white coconut, saltwater breezes, sun bleached woods. I don't smell woods. I smell sweet coconut. That's what I smell. I don't know white coconut from any other coconut, but that's what I smell. Sweet coconut. Saltwater breeze. I don't smell salt, so I don't know. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Golden Mango Lagoon, that's the next one. I think I only had one, maybe I have one backup of this, I'm not sure. But I wanted another one. Because, oh, it just smells so good. Okay, Sunny Mango, Saltwater Woods, and Coral Blooms. And I mainly smell mango, but it just smells delicious. That one, it's fantastic. Now, I didn't get a, um, a backup of, uh, what is it, Rainforest? What is that one? I've used it one time. I can hardly smell it. It's very light to me. To me, it's light. So I didn't get whatever that one is called. I can't remember now. The Rainforest one. Um, I can't remember. So anyway, I didn't get any backups of that one. And the one that I regret that I didn't get is the Watermelon Mojito. I really like that one. I think it smells fantastic and it lasts pretty good, but I didn't get a backup of it. I think mainly because I like these other ones a little bit better and I have so many, <laughs> but I really wish I had gotten that one. And maybe, maybe I will yet. <laughs> So, A Thousand Wishes. I know I have a backup of this one, but this is one of my all-time favorites from Bath & Body. Excuse me. Itchy nose. Yeah, this is one of my all-time favorite scents. It's good. Um, pink Prosecco, Sparkling Quince, Crystal Peonies, Gilded Amber, and Amaretto Creme. And that's the you know, sparkly packaging, and it's just gorgeous, and it smells wonderful, and I love it. So, now, can y'all guess what else I got? Now, we're gonna do some gingham. <laughs> We've got gingham love. This one is... Sugared Red Berries, Blushing Freesia, and Rose Meringue. And it smells so good. Yeah, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Alright, next up, Gingham Fresh. Now, these last three, I love them oh so much. But, this would be number three. Juicy Pear, Sparkling Clementine, and Fresh Daisies. Mm -hmm. Definitely Pear and the Floral. I don't know if I smell Clementine. I don't know if I smell any citrus. Maybe not right now, but I definitely smell the Pear and the Floral in there. That one is very, very good. So if anybody is watching this and you, you know, want something to buy, all of these are just fantastic. If you want something that is really pretty that you can wear out for a picnic or wear out for a date, any of these ginghams would do. I mean, they're fantastic. So my next one is Gingham Vibrant. This one is a lot like candied um, violet sorbet. It's a lot like it, but it's more, um, it's sweeter. It's more blackberry, I think. The 
um, candy violet sorbet is more violet and not quite as sweet, I think, in my opinion. Because I know, oh, I got it all in my face. Because I know somebody is going to say, well, I think the other is sweeter, but we all have our own opinions. And that's just my opinion. I love them both. Candy Violet Sorbet was why we were so excited to get this. Because we thought it was a dupe. I think they're very close. I think you can wear them together. You can interchange them, whatever. Um, but they are a little bit different. And this one, I think, is a little sweeter and more berry-ish. The other one's a little more violet. And Anyway, last but not least is Gingham Gorgeous. And while we just smelled the candle. Um, oh, did I read the notes on that one? On the Violet Candy Sorbet, it's Wild Blackberries, Candied Violets, and Soft Vanilla. <laughs> okay, so Gorgeous is Pink Strawberries, Peach Nectar, and Peony Blooms. And this is one of my favorites, too. Yeah, this one is my favorite. Hands down. And I can smell each note in this. When I first smelled it, I thought, all I can smell is a combination smell. I don't smell all the um, in-between things. But now, when I smell it, I actually get a floral. I get a, a strawberry. I get a peach smell. I have to kind of think about it and, like, sort them out. But I actually get them all. And I just... I just think this is such a beautiful scent. And this, I think, again, you could wear this to a picnic. You could wear it to a, you know, um, go on a date. You could wear it to a wedding. You could wear it for anything. It is, and I think you could wear this. I think you could wear these anytime. Now, the tropical ones, maybe not, but the gigums, I think you could wear them all year long. They're probably more of a summer, spring, spring and summer kind of smell, but you know, if you like them, wear, wear what you want, right? So anyways, um, if y'all could hit that like button and maybe hit the subscribe button, um, I am gonna try and get some videos out more regularly, but like I said before, I'm having a lot of troubles getting them out from out there, so, and I'm not at home very much now through the summer, so, um, I will try to keep up with it, but um, uh, anyways, that's uh, one more haul for me, and um, everybody have a fantastic weekend, or week, weekend, whatever it is now, I don't even know when this video is going out, so I hope everyone is doing well, how about that? All right, I will see you all soon, bye-bye.